I think the fertilized eggs have arrived. Yep, eggs have arrived. Very well packed. I'm suddenly rushing getting this incubator ready. I was reading the instructions, apparently you need to do a test run for two hours first before putting the eggs in. So I guess I'll just leave it for two hours. <laughs> so it's supposed to hit 38 and stay there. It's slowly creeping up. As I mentioned before, please ignore the fact that the caravan's a bit chaotic. It really has become the communal kitchen right now. But anyway, this is where I've had the eggs incubating. We're now on day 19. At this stage, we take the eggs from the rotating top level and down one level, and we just leave them there. And I believe we dropped the temperature down a bit too. I have been nervous with these eggs. I kind of have been worrying that I've done something silly or that after waiting 21 days we're going to get zero chickens. A few days ago I actually tried a, shining a torch through them and I got concerned because I only could see a little bit at the bottom with red veins. It turns out that's what you're supposed to see near the end of their incubation. So we've, I've got six eggs. One of them looks like it wasn't fertilized at all. It just glows clear. So hopefully, hopefully, fingers crossed, we get five chickens. So the instructions had said add 100 mils of water a day, I assumed, to keep it all humid in there. But as you can see, the water's just been sitting at the bottom. Maybe I read it wrong, maybe it was only 100 mils for the whole time. But yeah, a lot of water at the bottom. Apparently I'm not supposed to turn these anymore. Now we need to check what temperature that's supposed to be at. So I've had it at 38, although it's just slowly increasing right now because I've had the lid off. It needs to go to 37.5 now. I don't actually know how to change it. 37.5. I wonder if that was it. Oh well, I'll see if it stops at 37.5. I had to cheer on my phone. <laughs> the first chick is hatching! It's so exciting.
I've set up their next home heat plate one size lower one size higher so they can figure out what heat they prefer a bit of chicken crumb and some fresh water so I'm gonna just leave that to heat up and then transfer the oldest chick So the older chicks seem to be pecking at the newborn one, possibly going for the liquid that was still on the chick from the egg maybe, but I decided to move them over, even though two of them were less than 24 hours old, and they seem pretty happy. <laughs> So I'll leave the fifth chick in the incubator for 24 hours before transferring it over with the other ones. Crazy, yeah. Now got five chicks.